Hello there. Yes, you guessed it. It's time for another episode of terrible local body candidates you probably shouldn't vote for. And this time we're off to poor Nikki Wellington to meet Barbara McKenzie, who is running for the mayoralty in Wellington at the moment. Now, she's running on an environmental platform, considering herself an environmentalist who's a little bit worried that we're doing too much to make the city look pretty at the sake of the environment. And she also believes that the council needs to show more respect for views and ideologies that do not match their own. You can see where this one's going, can't you? Yeah, yeah, you, you totally guess that. Her Facebook feed, while severely limited, is full of this kind of stuff, as well as information that's been shared from pro-Russia sources, including RT. And nothing says balanced, fair journalism like Russia Today. There's also the fact that on her friends list there are people like Jaspreet Boporai here who's actually running in another electorate in the South Island I believe, I think it might be Southland, and she is a regular contributor to the Voices for Freedom regular broadcast that they do. And while Barb has been very active on social media and the internet for quite some time where she has made such wonderful claims like wearing a burqa is the same as getting your dick out in public and CNN has to be fake news so therefore can't be trusted. The real creme de la creme, the piece de resistance of her herness is actually her blog which for some reason she doesn't tell anybody about when it comes to any of the materials that she's put out around the election so far. What sort of wonderful things do you think might be in this blog? Naturally, there's pro-protesters stuff where, you know, the government's mean and horrible and tells them that they're mean and horrible and, and we totally shouldn't listen to the government because the protesters were obviously right about everything. Oh, and then there's a whole huge list. This is just a very small snippet, but there's a very long list of things that are wrong with children wearing masks that come down to things like ruining their teeth forever. Oh, and apparently it's systemic that English is going to be completely wiped out in this country and only Tadeo Māori is going to be allowed, or a mix of the both that she calls Tadeoglish. <sighs> and of course, like a number of these pages, the Great Reset is happening and that's exactly what's going on right now. Why can't you see that? But of course, none of it actually matters because it turns out that things like COVID tests don't actually work or exist. It's all just some great big conspiracy theory to make you go and get the experimental jab from Jab Cinder. So yeah, poor Nikki Wellington, maybe for your mere, just vote somebody who knows what they're doing, not crazy old Barb McKenzie.